Hello YouTube, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Gentil Garçon. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and turn on the bell notification in order to receive more videos like this. Today, I'm gonna show you how to replace the LED LCD display on a HP laptop. First thing you wanna do, you wanna power down your machine. Next, you wanna remove the battery from the machine in order to not let any uh, power circulate throughout the machine when you're doing this repair. So with the aid of a plastic power tool, you want to gently unsnap all the uh, clips that is uh, covering the, the, the broken display, right? So you want to take your time with it. You don't want to break your bezel, right? It's very fragile. So you want to take your time with it. You don't have to rush. Take it easy. Make sure that unsnap all the clips all around the bezel. as well as on the back of the machine. When it's all done, remove your bezel from the display. So remove the four Phillips screws that is uh, retaining the broken display, right? Gently. Lay the display down on the keyboard. So now, one thing I like to do, I like to tap or touch the surrounding case of my laptop in order to discharge any electrostatic electricity coming from my hand. So now you want to gently uh, remove the 30 pin uh, connector from the broken uh, LED, LCD. Right, so gently you wanna handle your new uh, LED LCD uh, screen, right? So you don't wanna break it. So gently you handle it and you will align your 30 pin connector back to the uh, receiver uh, connector as well, right? So as you can see, I'm not even uh, grabbing the connector himself. I'm grabbing the tip on the top and I'm pulling it towards me, making sure that it snap, right? So when it slaps, it's an indicator that tells me that uh, it's uh, fully connected, right? So I'm using an extra tip to secure the cable on our new LED LCD display, right? So now I'm pulling back those four Phillips screws and securing the new LCD in place, as you can see. You don't have to over tight your screw neither. Your Phillips screws, you know, as long as it is tight, it is tight. No need to over tight them. So I make sure you remove the clear product protector from the new uh, display, right? Don't forget it in there. When you pull it back, your uh, bezel. So now we are pulling back our bezel back in place and we are snapping it make sure that all the clips snap in place right so you want to do it multiple times go around it make sure that it's all flat all you know snap snap into place don't forget to subscribe of course And yes, it looks like it's all done. Thank you guys for watching my video. Uh, I'll see you next time with another repair video that I'll be doing. All right. So you guys have a good day. Bye.